Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you see from the title, I am having a birthday giveaway challenge. It's going to be a little bit different this year. If you're on Facebook, you know Facebook always says it's almost your birthday. Um, pick a fundraiser or whatever. And that's what I'm doing with my birthday giveaway. My birthday is July 29th. And um, so I want my birthday to be in celebration of the new nonprofit that I started, Artful Expression. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to be having a giveaway. And it's actually two giveaways within one, but um, let me explain. Okay, so the giveaway is going to run from July 14th, which is today, until August the 6th. And that is a Friday. And then I'll let, you know, um, let it go and probably until uh, um, that through that weekend. But it has to be postmarked by the 6th. So, um... I'll let it go through the weekend and maybe pull it on Monday or Tuesday. But for one part, one giveaway, there's nothing to send in like mail. So let me explain. Okay, so you know that I have been working on my uh, nonprofit trying to get no, date, no day, ugh, donations, trying to get the 1023 done. So this is what I would like to do for my birthday. And you don't have to send anything else, um, but... Um, I would like for anyone to donate a minimum of $5 and you get two points for every five that you donate. Um, do a VR or share on some other kind of media if you don't do videos and you'll get three points for that. Now, um, the prizes for that would be, I'm going to have two prizes. I'm going to be doing an 8x8 album, mini album, or a 10x12 lap book. And the first place gets a choice between those two. Second place will get whatever the other person doesn't take. Okay. I got to put my glasses on. Okay. So, um, and that's all there is to that. Do a VR and, and donate at least a minimum of $5. And you can do that on my um, PayPal or Zelle. If you do it on PayPal, please do it friends and family. Um, because I had some people to actually buy um, some stuff and they did it through the other way and it charges me so um, I price things the way they, they go so that I will have money for shipping and when they charge me it takes off from what I have to pay for shipping so I actually have to dip into the donation and I don't really want to do that so if you use PayPal please do friends and family and if you use Zelle you know it, it's just one way to send and that'll be linked below in the description box to remind you, as well as all the rules. Okay, the second part of the giveaway is this. You can do one or other, or you can do both. The second giveaway is um, you're going to get one point for each thing that you send in, or five points for a book to create journals with. I actually have um, uh, my first class coming up at a church, and um, I need to get some art supplies in before I get things started. Let me explain. Okay, the first thing is a sp whoops, spiral notebook. And this is like with a, you know, mixed media book or something like that. This has got 70 pages. It is a um, 9 by 6 Comes from Walmart. It's just mixed media, thick pages or whatever. They're like four... 99 or five dollars some it's somewhere around five dollars so you can send that in and i'm trying to get everything about the same size and everything the same because you know you don't want to get one child something that looks you know a whole lot different than others so just a, a general size like a nine by six book to create an art journal with and if you do send that in that's five points and the rest is one point each so you can send in um a box of colored pencils 12 count only, a box of crayons, which is 24 count, a small palette of watercolors, and what I mean is you can get the small little palettes that are like this long um, and send that in. And Dollar Tree has all these things here. But Walmart has a lot of things on sale, like the color pencils and the box of crayons, um, the watercolor palettes and markers they have for 50 cents right now. Uh, but the, the you can get a 12 count of markers. And then also I'm asking you to do a VR or share on your social media. And you'll get three points for that. 
So five points if you send in a blank journal, like the ring bound journal. And I'm, I'm asking it to be ring bound because it's easier for kids to do. Um, you get one point for a box of color pencils, 12 count, a point for a box of crayons, 24 count, a small palette of watercolor is a point, and a pack of markers, 12 count is a point. And then if you do a VR or share on social media, you get three points. Now for the second part of it, there's three prizes. And the first place winner will get its pick, and then the next, the second place, and then the third place will get whichever one the first two didn't get. So first prize for that one is, or here are the three prizes, and then that person can check. A prayer journal, a junk journal, and a four by six mini album. And like I said, you can enter both giveaways if you want to. Then out of all the giveaways, um, if you won either part one or part two of the giveaway, um, you know what? I'm just going to leave it all in there. I'm going to take all the people who have the top points from group one and group two, and there's going to be a grand prize. It'll be an eight by eight album, a prayer or junk journal, and a $20 gift card. That's going to be the grand prize. And I will, um, pick from either one of those. Now, one thing I want to tell you, please note about how these are handmade items and they may take up to a week for me to make. I'm going to try to get started on them now, but, um, you know, some, I like to have people be able to put some input that went it, but I will try to get general stuff. I've got two things I'm already making that people have already bought. So, um, this is open to U S and international. Now, if you win, please note, if you're international, please note that I can only ship a junk journal about, um, you know, just the regular small, looks like a travel notebook junk journal. I cannot ship a, a heavy um, album unless you are willing to help me pay the shipping on it. But what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get gift codes for my international winners. And if I can get some gift codes... Uh, from a couple people that I'm talking to now, my international may just be a separate drawing and for gift codes or something. I don't mind shipping a junk journal. I think a junk journal will ship for about $10 or something like that. I think it's either $10 or $12 is what a junk journal will ship for. But I cannot do a mini album. Um, I weighed one for the mini album to ship um, to London, and it was going to be $35. There's just no way I can do that. So, I will have all, everything that I said down below in the description box. And, um, you must be subscribed to my channel to participate in this. If you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And, um, and I would love to have everyone join me. I'm not doing this, um, pretty much to get more subscribers or whatever. But I am doing it to celebrate the 58 years that I've been on this earth. <laughs> um, to help start a new journey that I really felt like I've been led by the Lord to do. I'm so excited on this. I have been working on this project for three years. And, um, but uh, so many people have also been asking me about um, artful expression about they didn't really kind of understand some things. So I'll probably be doing a separate video. Well, you know what? Let me just do it now. <laughs> okay. Artful Expression is a nonprofit created by myself to provide kids of all races, all ages, all backgrounds and everything to be able to express themselves through art. Every time that um, I work with a group of kids, they're going to be able to create an art journal. And uh, one other thing I'm going to add on that list, excuse me right quick, is the um, uh, 8x10 canvas boards from Dollar Tree. Let me add that on there. And I'll put that down in the list. Okay. But anyway, they're going to be um, provided with art materials. So all the art materials that I asked for in the second giveaway will be given to each child. And um, so I really need some startup right now to be able to do that. Also... Um, we're, we're still lacking a little bit on the 1023. Otherwise I could get some of the company, um, company 
donors that have, you know, tentatively pledged to help with supplies, but they can't do it until I get approved for the 1023, which is a, um, a tax deduction for corporations and stuff like that. Um, but anyway, uh, I want to be able to provide uh, these kids a way to express themselves through art. <clears throat> you know, um, we've gone through some terrible times, especially the last couple of years. And it just seems like sometimes our country is falling apart. And I pray to God that it's not. But what disheartens me or breaks my heart even more is the fact that um, our kids are getting lost in this shuffle. There's so many racial tensions. There's so much, um, so much disparity. And among school districts and stuff, kids can't, there's many school districts that don't do art anymore because they can't afford it. And unfortunately, you know, our states aren't doing anything about it. There's such disparity between school districts and stuff. Studies have shown that kids who do creative art and express themselves through art do better in school. Um, it increases their knowledge, brain knowledge, ability to process things, ability to evaluate, and it just helps them in the long run, especially particularly in the business end of the world. And there are studies that prove that. You can link them below if you want me to. <coughs> but this is what I want to do. I want to be able to go into school districts that don't provide art anymore or into churches in low-income areas or anywhere then I can go and help kids to develop expressions of art. Why art journals? Well, you know, for me, I've always journaled writing and everything else. But kids don't always want to write a journal. Especially, God, you know, teenagers, boys, and, and stuff, they think that's sissy. But if you give them a book and you tell them to draw pictures or paint or collage or whatever they want to do to express themselves, it's art. And then they don't mind doing that. It also provides a link if they share it with family or parents um, to be able to start conversations or something. You know, what does this mean? This looks like you're sad. Are you sad? Blah, blah, blah. You know, and, and that helps. Helps bridge a gap of communications. But more importantly, art helps keep kids grounded and maybe out of trouble. You know, and that's what we want to do. We want to show, we want to show kids all over this country that somebody cares about them and that my my supporters in artful expression, you know, people believe in them and they need, kids just need somebody to believe in. You know, kids aren't born racist. They get taught that. And I'm trying to break those barriers and I realize I'm only one person. And, you know, I may not can change the world, but I can change the life of one child and that would mean the whole world to that one child. The motto of... Artful expression is the only colors we see are the ones that we put on canvas. And that's truly what I believe. I don't care what culture you come from, what color you are, anything. I don't look at that. I see art as a beautiful expression of who we are and what's on the inside of us to share with the world. There might be a young Picasso out there or there might be, you know, a, a truly great artist out there that is getting looked over because they don't have an opportunity or supplies to do art. And what these kids are going to do on these canvases, they're going to do a canvas at the same time they create the art journal, then they're going to do a canvas. And for people who want to support us on a monthly basis, they're going to be able to get a piece of original artwork for the children that we work with. And I just think that's so exciting. So I hope you participate in my birthday challenge. If you have any questions about artful expression, please leave them below in the comment section and I'll be more than happy to um, answer any questions for you. If you have any questions about the giveaway, um, leave those below. But like I said, in the description box below, you will find everything that you need to know about the giveaway. You will also find my PayPal and Zelle on there as well. Thank you so much. I hope that you all will choose to participate in this. If you've not subbed, please sub to my channel so that you can get involved too. Um, this, you know, these are my only ways that I'm able to give back. And I truly, truly want to do this and be able to go out into the world and spread the love of art. 
you know, whether it be card making, crafting, whatever. But I just want to spread the message that art is good and that people out there care about you and they want to see you succeed no matter where you're from and who you are. So God bless and I will see you all soon. Bye-bye.